For this project, you'll need some easy to find materials. You'll need a five millimeter LED of any color and a three volt coin cell battery. If you don't have these on hand, you can hack an electric tea light from the dollar store. You'll also need a white ping pong ball to form the head of your ghost, and then some craft materials like gauze, tissue paper, wax paper, or even plastic wrap to form the body of the ghost. You also need an awl or a screwdriver to put a hole in the ping pong ball. Now it's time to assemble your light. Orient your LED so that the long leg is against the flat, positive side of your battery, and the short leg is against the rough, negative side of the battery. It should light up. Use a bit of duct paper mesh to tape hold the light together so the LED doesn't wiggle off the top. Use your awl or screwdriver to gently create a hole in your ping pong ball. Widen it enough so that the bulb of your LED fits snugly inside. Add a bit of hot glue to hold it in place. Now it's time to have fun. Decorate your ghost. Here I used a bit of blue tissue paper under some medical gauze from a first aid kit to create the body of my ghost. I had a Google eyes and used a marker to make a little mouth. Use hot glue to attach a bit of string to the back of the ghost and then hang it for a bit of spooky fun. Fresh batteries should give you light for several weeks. There are a million different ways to decorate your ghost, so invite some friends over and have fun.